So hi friends, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video. So here I will provide you the most important video related to VIT Triple E 2022 examinations. That is here I will provide you the complete roadmap to get 110 plus out of 125 marks in VIT examinations. And once you get 110 plus you will easily get all type of branches in main campus and other campus as well. Whatever you will opt in the counseling process. So here basically I will provide you the complete roadmap that means number of chapter that is complete list of easy and important chapter and how you need to to cover that from where you need to solve a question so everything i will be talking about for all the subject that is physics chemistry math as well as aptitude and english also so complete information you will get in this video and this video is applicable to those students as well who haven't done any type of preparation wow. yet for uh, any entrance examination or the student who have done a little bit preparation for their board examination only so basically after following the process that i will talk in this video you will easily able to get 110 plus marks 15 to 20 days in the vit triple e 2022 examination so please try to watch the video till the end so that you will get the complete information about vit triple e 2022 preparation plan so first of all i will talk about the list of chapter each subject and how you can cover that also i will talk so let's get started with the physics what what type of chapter you need to cover in physics that i would like to talk so now first of all you need to go with current electricity and one more thing i would like to inform you before going forward for this video that is i have analyzed last three four years of paper of vit triple e examination and also by considering this year's syllabus that is official syllabus i am providing you the list of chapter and also i will provide you the method by which last year many students get the uh, get the good result in the vit examination in previous year as well that, that is, is in 2018-19 because that time the vit was used to happen like this year that is center but in 2020 there was no examination in 2021 there was a uh, home-based examination that means we are able to attend the examination from their home so there was lots of cheating as well so but now this year you have to go to the center for the examination so according to that i am providing you everything so that you can get better result in the examination so next so, that you need to cover in physics is modern physics that is complete modern physics there will be three four chapters in that modern physics that is whole nature of particle and photoelectric effect nuclei uh, all type uh, of concept uh, that comes under modern physics you need to cover and thereafter you can go with the last two chapter as well it is semiconductor and uh, communication system because there will be question from that as well so before moving forward for this video i would like to just update you about the examination pattern of the uh, vit triple e 2022 that is there will be 40 question from math 35 from physics and 35 from chemistry that is 110 and thereafter 10 question from aptitude and 5 question from english so all total 125 question and each question will give you one marks and there is no negative marking so you can attempt as many question as you want in the exam so let's continue this video that is next chapter that you need to cover is gravitation from class 11 and also you need dimension because that will help you to solve the question of other chapter and thereafter you can go with heat transfer and also you and can consider the uh, em wave chapter because that is a little bit easy and theoretical chapter so try to consider the chapter and after that you need to go with the alternating current so these are the chapter that, that is, is having more weightage in the vit examination so try to cover this chapter and after that if you will have time then you can go with the optics as, as well as the capacitance also so these are the chapter that you need to cover particularly in physics so now let's talk about what you need to cover in chemistry so first of all uh, in chemistry you need to cover spdf block of element that is inorganic almost all chapter are very important because that will be theoretical question and, and also and it is very uh, very uh, easy to cover in less time so i'm just advising you go with spdf block of element and thereafter you can go with the biomolecules and polymer because those are also very theoretical chapter and you will easily able to get the marks and after that go with last the last chapter of class 11 last chapter of class 12 as well it is environmental chemistry and chemistry in everyday life so this chapter will be very helpful and after that you need to go with the physical chemistry that is solid state surface chemistry kin chemical kinetics solution so these are the chapter that you need to cover and there are two helping chapter that is periodic table and redox reaction so you need to cover this and if your goc part is okay. good then, then you can, can go for uh, organic part as well but if your goc is not uh, good then i will not suggest because that will take lots of time so these are the chapter that you need to cover and also one more chapter that is chemical bonding from class 11 you need to cover because there will be multiple questions from that topic as well so these are the chapter that you need to cover from chemistry because this this chapter will have more weightage so you need to cover the chapter that will have more weightage and also i would like to remind you that every entrance exam needs different type of approach you can't go with the same approach in every entrance exam because here in vit level of difficulty will be low as compared to j mains 
so you need to go uh, with different approach here and you have to go uh, for a particular topic that will have more number of question you can't complete all the chapter in the, in the, uh, in the less time that's why i'm providing you the chapter that are easy and important in this act of vit triple e 2022 uh, if, if you, you want, want to get the strategy for j mains or j advance or comet k or a triple e you can watch my different video as well that is available in the same channel but here i am particularly focusing on uh, uh, vit triple e 2022 so now let's talk about the mathematics which type of chapter you need to cover as you all know mathematics will be one of the toughest but here you will get easy question you can relate it with your board exams as well because there will be similar question in the exam of vit as well so in mathematics first you need to go with vector and 3d because there will be multiple question from this chapter and also after that matrices and determinants so this four chapter will have at least eight to nine question in the examination so please try to cover uh, this thereafter there you are... need to go with probability and permutation combination because these three chapters are interrelated so you need to cover that thereafter complete the statistics and mathematical reasoning because there will be one or two questions from this chapter as well and it, and it will be very easy to complete in one to two hours itself so go with that and after that go with set relation function and trigonometry so these are the chapter that you need to cover in mathematics after that if you will have time then you can go with complex number differential equation so these are the chapter that you need to cover in mathematics and how you need to cover now i will talk the process so first of all let's talk about the process for physics so for physics you just need to take any reference book not the ncrt book from any reference book just get the concept and if you are enrolled in any coaching center or physics valla courses or an academy so you, you can, can take, take the concept from there but for question you need to solve only easy question if you compare it with same is then just solve the easy question or you can solve the board level question as well because here the what matters most is your speed and accuracy of course there is no negative marking but internally they will select those things because you will uh, you will see this thing in your ranking if even if you will attempt more questions you will get less rank because i have seen this thing in previous year that's why it is very advisable to solve all the questions correctly you can attempt as many as as you want because there is no uh, official uh, negative marking in the examination but you have to be very smart because there will be easy question but you have to solve everything fast because there will be 125 question within 2.5 hours so try to uh, try to listen my word and work accordingly and if you want complete mentorship from me that is personal guidance you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number so that i will guide you according to your personal interest because whatever chapter i have provided you that is in general but according to your personal interest there may be difference in the chapter so according to that i will be guiding you once you contact me through instagram or whatsapp number i will talk everything in detail and if you want you can join so that i will guide you first for the preparation to get the best result in vit and thereafter uh, for the counseling process to get the best out of your rank and it is not limited to vit only i will be guiding you for manipal if you, if you are appearing in that or for j and j advance as well it means complete guidance whatever exam you will appear i will guide you for that and for the counseling process as well so if you want you can contact me anytime through instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box so let's continue this video that is for physics i have, I have provided I have. you the detail that is you can go with any type of concept and thereafter you need to solve easy level of question and you can do it from and you can board solve board level question or you can solve the reference book question as well but you need to solve only easy question if you are particularly targeting vit but if you are preparing for j means you will easily able to solve the question of vit so next so now i would like to introduce the philo app where you can get the solution of all your question doubt or you have problem with any type of concept related to j or neat or boards examination then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps that is first you have to download the philo app in the play store and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number and after that take the photo of your question and upload that in the app and after that within 60 seconds you will be connected to the india's best education क्वेश्चन में आप कहना चाहते हैं कि बल्ब की पावर कितनी है अगर बल्ब जो है वो 220 वोल्टेज पर ऑपरेट हो रहा है राइट इस बैटरी का जो वोल्टेज है वो आपको गिवन है 220 तो ये आपको सिंपल रिलेशन हो गया यहां पर अब अगर कोई आपको और डाउट है तो बताइए सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग योर टाइम डाउनलोड द फिलो ऐप लिंक इज अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड यूज द कोड IEB001 यू विल गेट द 10% इंस्टेंट डिस्काउंट थैंक यू सो नेक्स्ट फॉर केमिस्ट्री just go with the ncrt and question of ncrt is sufficient and next if you talk about for mathematics then i will suggest you first get the concept from any reference book or your coaching center then try to solve the easy level of question of j means from any source whatever you have or you can search the previous year j means level question also that is easy shift paper 
because there are multiple statements uh, J means examination so for easy sip try to solve the math uh, math question so in this way you will able to solve more number of question on the examination and next let's talk about aptitude and english as if you are from cbsc i don't think you will have problem in english particularly and for aptitude also there will be easy question so no need to worry let's discuss the topic that you need to cover so for uh, aptitude you need to cover coding decoding part and uh, and uh, clocks calendar directions and number series so this is the concept the that you need to have to, to solve, solve the question of aptitude and and from english there will be question from comprehension english grammar pronunciation and also there will be question from interpreters so these are the thing that you need to cover from aptitude and english particularly to get 15 more question because they, this will be the deciding factor everyone will go with the pcm but if you will score more marks in this 15 question then you will easily able to cross the barrier of 110 marks and once you get 110 marks you will easily get everything whatever you want in the counseling process but you have to be very careful during the counseling process because once you do mistake other will take the advantage of it so it is very advisable to have a mentor or guider who can guide you for everything so that you will get the best out of your preparation now in the examination and after the examination you will get the best out of your rank and if you want you can contact me for that so that i will be guiding you for everything and it is not only for vit but for other entrance exam other counseling also whatever you will do this year so thanks for watching this video please try to subscribe the channel so that you will get all the update about vit and other entrance exam other counseling as well including jma j advance in the same channel thanks